I thought I'd give you a quick update on where I am with the control panel. I'm basically building two systems here. One is a high level track, uh, which is analog, and another, which is a low level track on two baseboards, well, in fact, three baseboards, uh, which is digital. Uh, so you'll see on the right there that I've got a digital controller from Hornby, uh, and just above it, uh, I've built a programming track. This will expand as the digital network uh, expands. On the left, I've got the analog control panel, which is made from plywood, and it's basically just a hinged lid on some supports, which gives a nice angle to the panel itself. The main part of the panel is a Gage Master Series UDS, this controls two tracks and it's got uh, simulators on both tracks. To the left is a mimic panel for the high level track, which shows where each of the points are. And you'll see some lettering on there and they correspond with the switches above, which are just pushed to make switches for each of the isolation sections. Over on the far left, I've got a Model W from Gage Master, which controls one of the sidings uh, and it's on a long flex uh, so that I can take the control across to the siding. And just to the right of the isolation buttons, I've got all the light switches, which control the various lights around the layout. As I said, the control box or the control panel itself is simply a lid which hinges uh, and of course it can lift up and show you uh, all the wiring inside, um, which looks a bit of a mess, but it works. And there's a, a PECO uh, CDU for the point switches. I take everything to these uh, chalk box terminators uh, and I've also started to use this Weissman unit which is really good because you just need to take it, the power into it once and then you can take off all the accessories from it. Uh, so I find it's really uh, worth the small amount of money it was uh, to put it in. And that's a DC Concepts uh, module there for flickering firelight. So there you are, that's the panel at the moment. Uh, I'll update it uh, again sometime in the future once I've got some more information.